My name is Doug Geinzer and I am the CEO of Las Vegas Heels and we are getting ready to start the uh, May ha Healthcare Happy Hour. It's, we're celebrating Cinco de Mayo and we're here with Danny Denton from the Nevada Partnership to Fight Chronic Disease. Welcome Hi. Danny. Thank you. So tell Thank us you. a little bit about the Partnership to Fight Chronic Disease. Well, we're an, uh, a state level organization, part of a national group. The National Partnership to Fight Chronic Disease has been around since 2007. Our state group is less than a year old, mm -hmm. but already we have a number of partners in Nevada, including Las Vegas Heels, um, the Osteopathic Medical Society, uh, the Lou Rubo, uh, Cleveland Clinic, uh, just to name a very few. So why is chronic disease such an important issue here in Nevada? Well, believe it or not, in Nevada we have 1.7 million residents with at least one chronic disease. Wow. We're a small state. Sure we That's are. a huge number. And yet, a lot of these chronic diseases can be pre prevented or better managed. And our goal is to get information out there so people are aware of the importance of chronic disease and also of the things that we can do to curb the incidence of chronic disease. So chronic disease costs the healthcare system an awful lot. It probably costs more than any other thing out there. Tell us about that and how does your, what, what are your efforts doing to curb that expense? Well, in Nevada, we're talking about $401 billion wow. of the next 15 years treating chronic disease. Wow. You know, and we're talking about uh, basically if we don't do something to stop the increase, in 15 years it's going to be $8,400 per person in Nevada just to address So this is a big deal. Right. Yes. This is a big deal. Whereas, you know, we've identified certain steps that can be taken that will save basically almost $4 billion a year wow. in costs, plus hundreds of thousands of lives just here in Nevada. And we're not talking about difficult steps, we're talking about just some basic lifestyle changes. Like, if we could get just a 5% reduction in the obesity and overweight of course. rates, that would contribute. If we could get more people to actually do physical activity, if we could get more people to actually follow the treatment plans that their doctors prescribe, if we could get more money into research to halt the onset of Alzheimer's and to do better management of cancer and curing cancer. If we could do just some of these things, we would save lives and we would save money. So what type of action should people take to help you support your cause? You're here for a reason. What should people yeah. be doing? Okay, the basic takeaway, what we want people to do is we want you to listen to your political candidates. Everybody's running for office right now. And yet, how often have you heard one political candidate address what they plan to do to fight chronic disease? That's what we're asking. Before you give your vote, ask the candidate, what do you plan to do about chronic disease? Because if you're talking about health care and health care costs, and you're not talking about chronic disease, you're not addressing the problem. Thank you all for your sponsorship. Thank you for being here. Obviously, chronic disease is important to each and every one of us. Las Vegas Heels is very proud to sponsor and be part of and support the Nevada Partnership to Fight Chronic Disease. And again, Danny, thank you for everything that you're doing in this thank day. Thank you. It's great having you here.